Pope Francis convoked uh, two synods over the over consecutive years to reflect on the nature of the family. He's now released a document entitled The Joy of Love. Pope Francis speaks about the family as the place of love and gives a beautiful exposition on the nature of love in the human context of the family. He speaks in a real and compassionate way about the concrete reality of family life. The world has come to know Pope Francis as one who is deeply interested in people and in the struggles that people do experience during life. And this comes through in this document. He doesn't so much speak about great and lofty and noble ideals about family as about really the realities of the lived experience of family life. He understands that family is always, if you like, a work in progress. And he speaks about the experience of family as being, as in his own words, a dynamic path to personal development and fulfilment. He describes the role of the church as one of accompanying couples on their journey. He sees the church as being there to assist what he calls the wounded families, describing the church more like a field hospital. In the case of difficult situations, like those people who have been divorced and have remarried, he encourages what he has called the logic of pastoral mercy. He wants people in such situations to know that the church still welcomes them and wants to support and help them. The Pope recognises the rich and complex reality that family life is, and he wants the church to give pastoral attention to the reality of the family as it is experienced. This document shows his deep understanding of the human condition. Pope Francis wants the church to be a source of comfort and companionship for every family that experiences difficulties or suffering. This document is positive and hopeful. And while the Pope clearly presents traditional Catholic teaching on various issues concerning marriage and family, it is always with pastoral compassion.